Hi everyone, welcome back to Lead Coding. I'm your host Faraz. So I hope you guys have been solving the questions from the interview preparation series and we are currently on the topic dynamic programming. So we have solved quite some questions on dynamic programming till now and now it is time that I check your progress that if you're actually learning it or not so for that I'm going to give you an assignment that assignment will consist five questions try solving these questions and let me know in the comments that how many of these five questions could you actually solve by your own so in case you need some help in case you want me to make a separate video of those questions do let me know in the comments so now it is time for me to check your progress so let us go to each of those questions one by one the first question is house robber so you can go through the problem statement It is a very simple dynamic programming problem and the prerequisite is only the videos which we have already covered in dynamic programming so if you guys are new here just check out this playlist in which I'm teaching all the important topics that are necessary for your interview preparation with a lot of example questions so you must have done these questions from dynamic programming after doing this you can actually proceed and solve this one so the only prerequisite is that you will be able to solve this the next question is perfect square okay so the link of all these questions I will provide in the description the very important thing is you should first know how to read the problem statement so for that you will have to practice okay if I always try to make you understand the problem statement it will be difficult for you to understand the problem statement during an actual interview so try to understand by yourself the next is buy and sell stock with cooldown we have already covered uh, buy and sell stock and that was in the starting of the playlist we have covered four part of this problem this is the fifth part and this you can do using dynamic programming then the next problem is very famous coin change problem okay it's a very famous problem and a very frequently asked one all these problems which I am covering are frequently asked so you don't have to worry about that all these questions are from actual interviews next is counting bits okay this is also really interesting so I want to see how many of you could actually solve all these five problems I hope um, there will be no difficulty in solving these four problems which are in the starting there will be absolutely no difficulty you just have to follow the procedure which I have taught in the previous videos and you'll be able to easily solve these questions now about this there's a little tricky part where like most of you will be able to uh, figure that out I just want to see okay I just want to see how many people can actually solve five questions even if you are able to solve these four questions I will be really happy to know that so make sure that you leave your comments down below that out of these five how many questions could you actually solve alright I will meet you guys really quick just try to solve all these questions when I think that enough number of people have solved these questions I will either upload the solutions to those which are difficult or those in which you find difficulty otherwise I will proceed with other topics so quickly do these questions and do let me know in the comments. Thank you.